filming? Are you filming? I am. Hi. What are we doing? Welcome to the Eclipse viewing party. Hey, look everyone. Go blind. <laughs> okay, so we're outside waiting for the eclipse, just staring up at the sun. I used to do that a lot when I was younger, stare at the sun without glasses on. Um, I'm excited. Not because of the actual eclipse itself, I'm excited for the possibilities of destruction, chaos, and a zombie apocalypse. I'm not excited for that part, but I'm excited for everything to get dark. And we're out here earlier in the beating hot sun, and now it feels so cool. It's like the it sun does. doesn't feel like it's, it's trying to melt me. It's almost like the moon is covering the sun. It's almost like that. It has begun! Hi. Okay, so any second now, it's about to happen. Um, what's about to happen, John? The eclipse, Brittany. Well, what's it called? Totality. Finish him! Totality. <laughs> it just sounds like something that should be a Mortal Kombat. Um, yeah, we live in Greenville, South Carolina, which is one of the best locations for Totality. I keep looking up at it. That's I'm going to go blind. With I an, keep looking at it. By the too. end of this video, I'm going to go blind. By the way, you can glimpse at the sun. I've done it my entire life. If you just glimpse up, you're not going to go blind instantly. You can't see anything. I'm not a medical professional, but I am a guy who makes YouTube videos, so you can trust me. Everything's a little bit darker out, but I'm waiting till everything goes completely dark in the middle of the day. Something about that relaxes me. It frightens me and scares me at the same time. It's like your ideal day. It is. Yes, I'm a vampire, <laughs> and now I'm allowed to be out during the day. I'm now a daywalker, Brittany. <laughs> I'm almost Blade without the skills. See, the camera can look right at the sun. I think what? it. As I make, as everyone's going blind right now, I don't know. The last eclipse, how many years ago was the last eclipse? Uh, I read 1918, you told me 1918. 1918? No, Walter Cronkite did this video right here 36, 7 something years ago. Good evening, for parts of North America, the sun went out today. For a little under three minutes, the forces of darkness ruled in daylight. So this very well could be the last eclipse a lot of you see in your lifetime. Is that slightly depressing? And the only. <laughs> and the only. Maybe. Maybe. What's Maybe. the next one? The next one is fact check Google with <laughs> editing power. <laughs> Boom! Right there. That's the next eclipse. The total eclipse. Eclipse of the heart. <laughs> By the way, check out these killer lawn chairs. We bought these just for the eclipse. For two minutes. Zero gravity. Uh oh, it's getting dark. It's getting dark. I'm pulsating. I'm looking at it. There it is, guys. No glasses. It's safe. Look at that. Ow, ow! Okay, so that was the eclipse of 2017. We waited a few decades, and was it worth it? Eh, it was okay. <laughs> <laughs> it was cool. I will say, I just wanted it to last longer. Two minutes is not enough. I wanted days of darkness and decay. I wanted, this is what I wanted to happen, Brittany. Mm -hmm. I wanted the sun to heat up the moon, the moon explodes, tidal waves come hundreds of miles inland, the, the sea washes up at my feet, I don't drown, I survive the zombie apocalypse, I'm sorry, the post-apocalyptic wastelands. Our neighbor's looking at me like I'm insane right now, but that's okay. But that's what I wanted, but either way guys, let me know your thoughts, your opinions down below. So let me know what you guys thought about the uh, solar eclipse of 2017, what did you guys do for it, and what did you... What did you want to happen that didn't? I at least wanted an EMP. So let me know your thoughts and opinions down below in the comments section. And we'll see you guys next time.